Java Balls! Here we are, I'm back. I have this knees coming on. <laughs> so, okay. Here's my little angel wing. I will use shadow gray and come in and define the feathers. The secret to this kind of painting is how little paint you put on the brush. And I put my, if you watch, I'm barely, barely, barely breaking the surface of the paint. And you can hardly, there's hardly any paint on my brush. I can't stress it enough how little paint you should use. Also, how kind of you can't afford to dilly dally in doing this because the paint dries pretty quick. So, right now, I'm going to go in and lay out the basic outline of the feathers where they're going to be. And when you're doing angel wings they there's like three levels of feathers a really short ones on the deep inside then the middle levels then the long ones that go all the way out what you don't paint is just as important as what you do paint I laid in the outlines for the first feather, so now as I get to those with the second row, I'm kind of leaving that the tip of the feather black. Here's the really long suckers. Why shadow gray? Shadow gray has a very cool uh, color tone. It's a cool color. And I like to try and infuse my blood angels, which have a very warm color scheme, with cool colors wherever possible. So you won't see much of it, but uh, you'll see the cool colors underlying the grays have a small effect kind of a subtle little tip it's as simple as that a couple of little um, colors laid in this thing is uh, just like the the wing part doesn't have feathers on it Let's zoom in a little for you See what I'm doing? Something's up with my camera. I don't know. Do knew what's going on with the camera. It's kind of hard to focus. Let me come back. <laughs> 